Hello all. In this tutorial, we will learn what is Jira used for and how to install and set up Jira. What is Jira used for? Jira was designed and known as a bug reporting tool. Now it has evolved into a test management tool. You can also manage project and tasks from requirement till the delivery of the project. Jira installation and setup steps. Download Jira software from website. I have shared the website URL in the comments below. Install it in local machine and then we will set up admin user and then add new project. To download Jira software server, go to the given URL and on the web page, you will find the latest release. For now, the latest release is 8.9.0. Select the operating system and click download button. It will ask you to agree the license agreement and privacy policy. Click the checkbox and click submit button. It will start the download. To start installation, click on the exe file that we have downloaded. Start the installation. In the installation wizard, click next button. Then select the express install and click next button. Now click on next button. Installation is complete. Click finish button. After installation of Jira, it will start automatically having the URL localhost colon 8080 port. So if you get such kind of error that your localhost 8080 port is not working, then you have to change the port. So how to change the port? To change the port, go to server.xml file which is there in your user folder atlassian jira conf and open server.xml in notepad and change the port there. Why do we need to change the port? It's not always but sometimes when you already have some application which is working on that port 8080 because all the applications or all the servers which we download it by default takes 8080 port. If that port 8080 is already in use then you have to select another port for your next installation of any server. So now we have installed Jira and I'm facing that issue because I already have some other server on that 8080 port. I need to change it. Open this server.xml in notepad. I have changed this port to 8090. Save this and close this server.xml file after changes. And then go to your startup menu programs Jira software. Here you will find the commands to start and stop your Jira server. You can start the Jira server now. Double click on start Jira server. It will start the Apache Tomcat. And your server will start. Once the server is started, go to localhost colon. 8090 port or 8080 port whatever your port is and it will start the Jira. The Jira setup will be displayed. There are two options here. One is set it up for me and another one is I will set it up myself. Select set it up for me and click continue to my Atlassian. Here provide your credentials through which you want to log in to Jira. Once you provide login credentials, it will ask you your full name and uh, the password for login to Jira. And then it will send mail for verification of your email to the given email ID. Once you click on the verification button given in the email, you get logged in to 
jira and here it asks for trial license of jira software server or jira software data center we want jira software server we will select this and we will provide the details this is our server id and we have got this license trial support license for 90 days provide the organization details and then generate the license after license generation you get the confirmation click yes and it opens the administrator account setup details for you which is our first user setup or first account setup i will set up the account by giving the email id username password and retype the password and click next clicking next it will show you this message that it is finishing your setup and it may take some time once the setup is done jira is ready to go message is displayed and it also gives you the address to access the jira quickly from the web browser click on let's get started button next page on the jira is to select the language select language as per your requirement and click continue button you can choose the profile picture if you want and click next button clicking next button it will ask to create the project click on create new project in the create project pop-up box we will select the basic software development here there are different projects project management process management task management or scrum software development kanban software development and basic software development we will select basic software development and click next in the next pop-up it gives you the basic workflow and issue types which you will get in this project click select button then give the name to the project giving the name to the project it gives you the key to the project this is our first project you can give any name to the project and we will see the different projects uh, available in jira in later tutorials also we will see the admin settings that are available with jira click submit button and your project will open in jira this way we install and set up jira we add the first user that is admin user and create our first project in jira please do like and subscribe by clicking button given below this video for any questions please mention in the comments below Thank you.